Bros play. Oh. Get past the laser. Get past Welcome the laser. Welcome back. <laughs> I love how close that I managed. I managed to save that in the perfect spot. Yeah, it was definitely great for this whole arcane scene. Oh, I like that arcane. Well, it reminds me of uh, the Diablo color scheme. The arcane odds. I think, uh, yeah, Blizzard likes to depict arcane as purple. Which I suppose is not a bad premise, because ice is blue, fire is red, and then arcane is sort of like a mixture of both arts. <laughs> you know, when someone says the arcane arts, they're not really talking... Ah! ah! They're just talking magic in general. <laughs> <laughs> you definitely were a deer in the headlights right there. It's the... Yeah, it's the... Look at this dude right here. It looks like a little dude. It's like a snakehead. Oh, yeah, it's like, oh, ah. thank you for using my nose as, a, as an obstacle. I feel like he's not thanking you. I don't know why a snake would talk like this. I keep thinking you're gonna bounce right into that laser. Have you seen the new Jungle Book? Uh, the live action one? No. Yeah. I've wanted to though. Um, some pretty uh, prominent voice actors are playing the, uh, the dudes. Well, I'm pretty sure I recognize the voice that played the panther back in the day. You might have. It's amazing how many of those scenes they recycled in order to save um, on animation cost. Really? Oh, oh yeah. I can I can definitely see that. I didn't know that the Disney animation team has animated virtually every Disney princess movie. Yep. So like the Frozen movies, Rapunzel. Yeah. Have you seen the theory about that? Um, what's it called? Um, that Anna and Elsa are not sisters. Oh, that they're actually teen lovers. No, oh. not at all. I was really hoping for that. They're not even half sisters. I, I, I've been banking on that for a while. Well, I, uh, I won't give it away, but uh, the basic theory is that Rapunzel is more involved in the story than you think. Rapunzel? Yeah, that Rapunzel and the story of Frozen, uh, they happen three years apart. Interesting. In the actual stories and the movies were released three years apart. Just go listen to the uh, film theorist video on why they're not sisters. Oh! <laughs> you could not have gotten crushed harder. <laughs> you got slammed by a rhinoceros and pounded into dust. <laughs> and the boys could not be crushed harder. Even if they tried. Mm. Can I teach you how to say douche uh, in it with a Boston accent? Yes. All right. So you're gonna want. This is this is not mine, by the way. The Game Grumps taught me this. Uh, you want to put your tongue right up against the back of your top te teeth, and then kind of make like an O sound with your mouth. Mouth. Douche. 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 <laughs> <laughs> I love the tongue to the teeth. It's so awkward too. And you gotta like always like it's gotta have a little more um, oomph. Well, that too. But it's like it's much better when you also swear. It's like, hey, look at this fucking rhino douche over here. It's definitely true. The Boston accent definitely goes with the word fuck, like peanut butter and jelly. God damn it. You're trying to get him trapped in it, but he's actually a really smart rhino. He's a smart fucking rhino. If only the, the, the rhinos of our day and pandas <laughs> were that smart. I feel like... Oh! oh. Ah. Ori has stopped no. working. Ah. It... Uh... Wow, this is a very simple pause menu. Oh, not happy about it, brother. This is not what I had in mind. <laughs> Here's your new sink. Oh, boy. No. <laughs> Jeez, this is going all kinds of terribly. There we are. We're back on track. Okay, I so... I um... are the hardest. <laughs> what the fuck were we talking about? Sorry, what'd you say? I think those purple projectiles are the hardest to dodge. Those really thin ones that shoot in arcs. Yes, those are very hard. They're very tiny and they do a lot of damage. Yeah, this... Ow. That guy only charges when you're in the level and he returns when you're not there. Yeah, you just gotta get out. But I want to crush him, brother. I prefer to deal damage to my enemies. I want to crush him. I want to crush Try him. Try jumping right underneath it. Like jump right from where you were standing to underneath that block and then back. 
Whoa, I, I even yeah, just damage. So jump all the way there. You blew it. You blew it! And then jump back. Yes! Well done. Yes! This is a lesson. <laughs> <laughs> and so was that. Oh, man. Anyway, what I meant to say was that if you can't crush someone on your own, always get help. Ask for advice, yeah. yes. Fuck. These are really vicious. I love how they have this set up. <laughs> yeah, the separation from him is probably the best thing you're going to get. I don't think you can run past. Oh, I just wanted to have done it once. Barely <laughs> ran past. I like that nothing is impossible at all in this game. It's just you have to go really slowly or things just stack up on you. Yeah. <laughs> that would be so dumb if that was the uh the like the the line on the box. It's like Ori teaches you that nothing is impossible. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> well, she's not wrong. We found an energy cell. I got two oh, energy cells now. That's actually a huge deal. Two. Oh, so that's already where we oh, wait, drop down there. Never mind. Never mind. Um, that's where. No, yeah, that's where, that's where we, we just from. were. Did you like that? How that, like that, the jumping up the wall, and then getting onto the brick, like while it was moving up and down. I thought that was pretty fucking clever. I feel like everything in this game. Is, oh, that guy can crush that bridge. Oh, I didn't save, motherfucker. I had two fucking energy cells and I didn't save. We did, didn't use them. Didn't save. Oh well. It's cool that you also get your two energy souls. Ah. Jesus. Yeah, I don't think you can. I don't think you can always predict those blocks. They don't fall the exact Ooh. same. Oh. So narrow. I love that the foreground stuff moves too, even though it's not actually part of the game. Yeah. Have you um, have you seen the trailer for? I think it's called The Shallows or Shallow Water. It's a uh, shark it's Shallow movie. Water, I believe I've heard of. Yeah. It's a shark what movie? No, I, I haven't. I haven't even seen a trailer for it. I just think I've heard the name. Oh, it looks good. Save, 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 save. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like you're getting way too good at this part. Uh, uh. <sighs> oh, okay. I actually didn't see that coming. I uh, yeah, barely did. These these blocks keep freaking me out. Will you get crushed if you go to the top even? Yes. Save, save, save. I'm gonna save down here. here I go. really like the impact. Like it, it's just like it feels like it's a block dropping on your head. Yeah, very much. It's also very finite. When Ori gets hit by it, she's just instant gone. Wait for him to. He fell into poison. Oh, I'm pretty sure later. Oh, didn't go anywhere. I, I'm pretty sure you unpoison the water at one point. Oh, so those become important. Yeah. So that's just natural, that's just normal water that's been poisoned. It's not like poisonous water. Um, yeah, yeah, it's been poisoned along with like the because, corruption. Cause the, yeah, because the, the place got blinded. <laughs> the forest became blind and the water became poison. It's better than your eyesight becoming poison eyesight. And you're just poisoning everybody you look at. Poison vision. Poison vision, that'd be pretty OP for a little while. For a little while. You like the Midas touch. It's yeah, yeah. Pretty sweet. But yeah. It's got limits. Then your friends come over and you just poison them all to death by it. You're like, oh, look at this. Hey, guy. you want a beer? Not from you, you fuck. <laughs> I'm not sure if yeah, I Yeah, I don't think that. we're supposed to go this way. Is there a mappy poo? A mappy poo. I think we have to go up. Yeah, hmm. I think. Is there any way to. What? Oh. Is there a way to bait an enemy into breaking that? Hmm. Probably not. Uh. This is a huge map. It is massive. And it's only in one little area. Whoa. Yeah, let's what go. What did we do this in this direction? See, I think we weren't supposed to. Yeah, we're supposed to go downwards there, I think. That's somewhere along the line. I thought this was uh, a bit of an offshoot. Mm-hmm. At least you got him. <laughs> I got him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, these blocks are vicious. This is fun. <laughs> What was it? Or no, that wasn't a ShamWow commercial. It's a golf swing. What's you know, that? You, um, Steve 
uh, Mickelson. Mickelson? Yeah. Um, he's a golfer. Oh. Pro golfer. And he's doing this one shot. He's standing in the in a bunker, like one of the sand areas near right. the green. And he's like, "This shot is fun." Oh, I think I've seen that yeah, before. I think I showed it to you, Phil Mickelson. That's isn't it. he a isn't he a badass golfer? Yeah, he is actually a really good golfer. And the shot does look like a ton of fun, <laughs> but just when it comes out of his mouth, <laughs> it's just like, man, you. Oh, you, oh no! That guy is a bastard. He is. Not Gumo's hideout. Oh shit, we know his name now. We can find the motherfucker. I know your name. Gumo, now you're I going find down. You. Shit. Oh, Goom. I'm pretty sure I can get up there. Oh, this level. Okay, so you're definitely gonna get crushed in there. Yeah, everything in this game feels like it's actually happening. Like, those things feel like they're stones striking each other. Now, this reminds me of something from Plague Knight. Or shovel knife. Yeah, yeah. Oh! Oh no. I like things like that where there's no physical room to go. You yeah. actually have to choose the right path. Yeah. It's almost like those puzzle boxes that just have one piece missing. There's only a single way that you can get there. Oh, I was just talking to somebody about those. I loved that when I was a kid. Oh, Ooh. wow. Nice. Nice timing. Hey, buddy. Yeah, those so, guys were menacing before, but I feel like we've got some firepower upgrades. Oh, no. I need to save on the other side of that. Yes, yes, we will get through the blocks. We will save. Remember, we have two now. Yeah. What's I, that green um, thing? Oh, boy. Uh, I remember um, how much I enjoyed that. This is tight. That, that puzzle that you're talking about? Yeah, the slide puzzles. Yeah. It's, uh, go back and grab the green thing. Well, you gotta to save, too. Hee! <laughs> I believe those are actually, uh, they were originally in Chinese puzzle boxes. Yes. That was like the, uh... uh what green thing are you talking about? There was a green orb in, uh, yeah, so go in there and then go down. Oh, yeah. yeah sure. I think that's just health. Oh. Really? Oh, it looks like experience. Oh, no. It's just <sighs> a large, large sprite container. We're actually so close to another point. I kind of like this, the the way that she has to jump to k stay on the wall. Later on in the game, when they add in the the wall grab, it actually takes away from that. Well, it makes it a lot less dexterously uh, challenging. Yeah. Oh, okay. Get out, brother. Get out, brother. Get out. Nice. Do just pop and... another save? Um, should I? Yeah, whatever. We get two, right? Yeah. Later on in the... Fuck. <laughs> Later on in the game, you can actually resave. Oh, at that point. At those points, yeah. Oh, that would be pretty sweet. I like how I just pretend that he doesn't exist. Like, peace, bro. Yeah, well, enemies spawn so much that if you ever really needed experience, you could just grind through them. Oh, I got the points back. Oh, thank you for joining us. Yes, yes, thank you. The forest thanks you. Visually, this game is phenomenal. Oh, you. Oh, you're so amazing.